Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today we got another package from Writestuff, anime.com. Um, I pretty much buy exclusively from Writestuff now. As far as anime goes, they always have the best price. Writestuff still always has their daily deals and weekly deals and weekend deals. So uh, you can pretty much have deals all year long. Um, you just kind of have to be looking at the site every, pretty much every day of the week. But anyways, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this one open. Let's see what we got in here. All right, so we got two items. One of them is a big one, or a big release. So we have the Fire Force Season 1. limited edition oh so we got two big ones uh two big releases this one is only part two i already have part one which i had have done an unboxing for and this is the weathering with you limited edition steelbook um i'm actually not gonna open this one just because um soon after purchasing this one they did announce the 4k box it which I am I already pre-ordered so I'll be waiting for that one uh, but this is a really nice steel book we can at least look at it through the shrink wrap I honestly would like to open it just to watch it because I haven't seen this one yet but no I can wait I'd like my first experience with this one to be through uh watching it in 4k I haven't really seen too much anime in 4k so I'm I'm excited to see how this one will look. So yeah, I'll probably post this one on Mercari or something if you guys are interested. Um, I'll have a link down to my store down below. I'll post this one sometime this week. So for today, the only one we have to unbox is this limited edition for Fire Force Season 1 Part 2. Let me go quickly go get part one just so you guys can see both of them. All right, so here we have the Blu-ray for season one, part one. Recently, Funimation has been doing this where they release part one, uh, the standard Blu-ray, and then part two is the limited edition box set, which is kind of weird. I think in the past they used to do it backwards. Part one would be the limited edition box set and then part two uh, would be the standard release. In my opinion, it'd be better if they could just release a season with both parts and the limited edition with both parts instead of having to wait because I basically haven't seen this one because I've been waiting to get this one before I start it. Now that I have it, uh, I might end up watching it sometime this month. But let me go ahead and take out the shrink wrapper so we could take a closer look at this one. All right, so here is the front. Uh, these bands here, some of the parts in the front look kind of shiny, have sort of like a shimmering effect to them. And then there's also like a rough texture on some parts. I'm actually not too sure if this is supposed to be blush, but I'm not sure. I haven't seen the anime, so maybe it's something related to, to their powers. Oh look, even their eyes sort of have like that small little shimmer effect as well. So that's pretty cool. Alright, so that one's the front. Here is the spine. Which will look nice on the shelf. I actually really like how these look. Looks pretty cool. And then here is the back. Here's some of the Blu-ray information. So we get DVD, Blu-ray, Blu-ray does have English 5.1 surround sound, and this one is TV 14. All right, looking up here, here are some of the extras that we get inside of the box set, which we'll take a look at in a little bit. All right, and when we take this guy off, we are treated to some more nice artwork here on the back. So I think this is the same guy as the front, the main character, I think. 
I'm not sure who this guy is. I, ha I actually haven't seen him in any of, any of the trailers or anything. Um, but yeah, his blade here sort of has that shimmer effect as well. So pretty cool. Oh, we have sort of these fireballs here on the bottom. Uh, but anyways, now let's go ahead and go inside. So we get a booklet. It isn't a hardcover, so that's unfortunate. And we get some a box with a little bit of extras, which you guys know how I feel about this. I don't really like it when, when they put a box that won't be able to stay in there because once I put this one in there with part two, this is no longer gonna fit. Uh, but anyways, here's the standard Blu-ray for Fire Force season one, part two. So yeah, here it is next to part one. So on part one, they're kind of all facing forward. And then in part two, they're showing us their profile. Here is the spine, then one part one, season one part two. And then here are the back. So I won't go over this, we kind of already went over the, the Blu-ray information. But going inside we have the same artwork. And then we got the digital copy, which I will be using and the disc. So I believe all the discs have the same art. Yep, they do. Uh, but we do get some nice background art here. So it looks like on this one we get um, all of the girls in the series. All right, I don't remember what the background was the background art was over here so let's take a quick look at that so season one part one had all the all the guys and season one part two has all the the females female characters all right so next let's take a look at the booklet oh god i've been recently getting into manga that now it actually feels weird to hold a book this way. I was trying to open it this way, uh, which this is actually the back. So again, we have sort of that blood splatter or whatever that is. And it's pretty cool. It actually looks like it's being removed from the banner here. And then we have this text here on the back. And then on the front, we have uh, this guy again with the sword. I'm assuming he's the antagonist from the show. And we got our main character up here. All right, I'm gonna flip through this one so you guys can take a look at some of the art in here. So we got a little pencil art in the back. Some nice poster art. Ooh, that one's pretty nice. Then we got some of the character information. Here's this guy again. He kind of looks like a little kid, to be honest. Then we got our main characters. So that's what you get inside of the art book. I would have liked to seen a hardcover, uh, but yeah, Funimation usually does do the paperback stuff. I'm gonna put that one right there. And then the last thing we have to look at
is the extras, which has seven art cards, keychain, and a badge. So let's go ahead and take a look. First thing here are the art cards. which they all do look pretty nice. Uh, the front part of this one actually feels sort of like laminated. They usually don't feel this way, but this one feels pretty, pretty nice. And on the back, they all have the same, same logo. All right, what else we got in here? have this little keychain here. We have another keychain here from the, the main character. And then we just have the, the Fire Force badge, which is sort of like a pen. Probably won't be using this one. But yeah, here's everything that you get with this limited edition. We get the booklet, uh, the nice box, some of the extras here, and this is part one that I purchased separately. So yeah, as I mentioned before, I'm definitely excited now that I have both parts uh, to start watching this one. I have heard good things about it, so I'm excited to finally be able to watch it. Uh, if you guys have seen this one, let me know your thoughts. Uh, but for now, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks.